In today's digital age, the internet is the backbone of our global society. But what if something as distant as the sun could potentially bring it all to a halt? In this video, we'll explore the intriguing and somewhat alarming possibility of solar flares disrupting our digital world. Welcome to our channel, where we dive deep into the fascinating intersection of technology, science, and history. If you're new here, my name is Jose and today, we're embarking on an electrifying journey to uncover how solar flares could pose a significant threat to our internet infrastructure. From the basics of what solar flares are, to the impact they've had in the past, and how they could shape our future, we've got a lot to cover. Stay tuned to discover why this celestial phenomenon is more relevant to your daily life than you might think. In the boundless theater of space, the Sun performs a relentless dance of nuclear fusion, a spectacle that fuels life on Earth and orchestrates our very existence. But within this fiery performance lies a phenomenon of both awe and concern, solar flares. Imagine, if you will, the sun's surface, roiling and tumultuous, marked by dark spots known as sunspots. These are not mere blemishes, but rather windows into the sun's magnetic soul areas where the magnetic fields twist and turn with intense complexity. It is here, in these turbulent zones, that solar flares are born. As the sun's magnetic fields twist and converge, they store energy like a cosmic spring being wound. When the tension becomes too great, the spring snaps, releasing a colossal burst of energy into the solar system. This is the essence of a solar flare, a magnetic storm on the sun's surface that catapults radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum. Consider for a moment the humble rubber band. When twisted beyond its limit, it yearns to return to its original state, and in doing so, releases energy. The sun's magnetic fields behave similarly, but on a scale that dwarfs our earthly analogies. When these fields realign, the energy released is unimaginable, manifesting as solar flares. Solar flares are not a monolith, but a spectrum, classified from C to X based on their intensity. C-class flares are the solar system's gentle whispers, often unnoticed. M-class flares, more robust, can cause minor radio blackouts on Earth. And then there are the X-class flares, the titans of solar energy, capable of disrupting satellites, communications, and even power grids. As we stand on the cusp of technological evolution, understanding these celestial phenomena becomes not just an endeavor of curiosity but a necessity. Solar flares remind us of our place in the cosmos, underlining the importance of vigilance and preparation in the face of nature's indomitable power. As we navigate deeper into the digital era, our reliance on technology has never been greater. Satellites orbiting Earth provide a lifeline for communication, GPS navigation, and even financial transactions. Yet this interconnected web of technology is more vulnerable than we might think, especially to the whims of our sun. Imagine for a moment, the Earth enveloped in a vast network of invisible signals, a digital dance enabling the flow of information across the globe. Now envision a solar flare, a wave of energy surging through space, reaching this delicate tapestry. When a powerful solar flare strikes, it's like a shockwave rippling through our technological systems. The immediate victims, satellites. These guardians of our digital world face the brunt of the energy, potentially leading to disrupted communication signals, GPS errors, and in severe cases, complete satellite failure. But the impact doesn't stop in the orbit. The Earth's magnetic field channels this solar energy towards the poles, igniting breathtaking auroras. However, this beautiful display masks a darker threat, geomagnetic storms. These storms can induce electric currents in long conductors on the surface, such as power lines and pipelines, risking overloads and widespread blackouts. To understand the potential scale, we need only look back to March 1989, when a powerful solar flare led to a geomagnetic storm that plunged the Canadian province of Quebec into darkness. The event served as a wake-up call to the vulnerability of our technological infrastructure to solar phenomena. In this era of global connectivity, Understanding the impact of solar flares on technology is not just about anticipating disruptions, but about building resilience. As we venture further into the cosmos and deepen our reliance on digital networks, safeguarding our technology against the sun's outbursts becomes a paramount challenge, reminding us of the need to harmonize our advancements with the natural forces that govern our universe. In the annals of history, few events have illustrated the intersection between celestial phenomena and technological vulnerability as vividly as the solar storms of yesteryear. These instances, markers in our ongoing dialogue with the cosmos, 
offer crucial insights into the potential impact of solar flares on our modern interconnected world. Consider the Carrington event of 1859, a solar storm of such magnitude that it became the benchmark for understanding solar flare impacts. Telegraph systems across Europe and North America, the cutting-edge technology of the age, were overwhelmed. Operators reported sparks leaping from their equipment, igniting fires and causing widespread communication blackouts. Imagine in today's terms, the internet going dark, a scenario that underscores our vulnerability to the sun's whims. Moving closer to our time, the 1989 Quebec blackout serves as a stark reminder of our escalating dependence on technology. A powerful geomagnetic storm, spurred by a solar flare, left millions without power, revealing the fragility of electrical grids to solar-induced currents. This event didn't just plunge cities into darkness. It highlighted the critical need for robust protections against solar weather. Another significant milestone occurred in October 2003, during a series of solar flares known as the Halloween storms. These flares disrupted satellite operations, impacted airline communications, and even forced the International Space Station to take protective measures. The Halloween storms serve as a modern testament to the sun's capacity to challenge our technological advancements. These historical precedents from the Carrington event to the Halloween storms are not merely tales of technological disruption. They are vivid reminders of our need to respect and prepare for the power of our star. As we continue to extend our reach into the digital and beyond, these lessons from history emphasize the importance of resilience and innovation in safeguarding our technological future against the unpredictable nature of solar activity. As we stand on the brink of a future ever more intertwined with technology, the lessons of the past guide us towards safeguarding our digital and technological infrastructure against the capricious nature of solar activity. The question then becomes, how do we prepare for a future where solar flares pose a persistent threat? In the face of these celestial challenges, scientists, engineers, and policymakers worldwide are forging the path to resilience. One of the forefront strategies is the enhancement of our satellite technology. By designing satellites with more robust shielding and fail-safes, we can ensure that these critical nodes in our communication networks stand a better chance against the harsh realities of space weather. Equally important is the development of sophisticated early warning systems. Leveraging a network of solar observatories and satellites, such as the Solar Dynamics Observatory in the SOAO spacecraft, we can monitor the sun's activity in real time. This vigilance allows us to predict significant solar events, providing precious lead time to secure vulnerable systems on Earth. Beyond the skies on the ground, efforts are underway to fortify our electrical grids. Engineers are implementing technologies to make power systems more resilient to geomagnetically induced currents. These include the installation of grid stabilizing devices and the development of protocols for rapid response in the face of potential disruptions. Perhaps most crucial in our journey towards future readiness is international cooperation. Understanding that solar flares know no borders, countries around the globe are collaborating through initiatives like the International Space Weather Initiative. This global partnership aims to share knowledge, data, and strategies, ensuring a unified defense against solar storms. As we continue to weave the fabric of our future, intertwined with the threads of advanced technology, our journey is illuminated by the knowledge and lessons of the past. Preparing for the impact of solar flares is not just an exercise in technological advancement, but a testament to human ingenuity and our collective resolve to thrive in harmony with the cosmos. Together, we step into the future, ready to face the challenges of tomorrow, guided by the light of our star. To sum up, while solar flares are a natural and relatively common solar phenomenon, their potential to disrupt our digital infrastructure is significant. Understanding, monitoring, and preparing for these events are crucial steps in safeguarding our technological society. As we've seen, the sun's fiery temper can have serious implications for the internet and, by extension, our modern way of life. But by staying informed and supporting efforts to enhance our digital resilience, we can help protect our global community from these celestial threats. If you found this exploration into the world of solar flares and internet infrastructure fascinating, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. Your support helps us keep investigating and sharing these intriguing topics. Until next time, keep looking up and questioning the world around you.